place has gone to shit. I ain't been down here in nary a decade. I own a 2,000 acre ranch up by Forney Lake now. I heard on the radio you'd been sighted up near Roswell. I figured you might show up here. Nothing in this house but bad memories. So why'd you come? You need a place to hide? You need money? Well, you're barking up the wrong tree, son. Far too late to come begging now. Ain't nothing you can offer to make up for what you've done to us. I think of my father, I see a fuck you and a fist flying in my face. When'd you ever do right by me? Disobedient, ungrateful, sense like a flat tire, and a mouth like a sewer. Oh, I saw where you was headed. I've been down that hole myself. And I guarantee goddamn to you, I did all in my might to pull you out. What more do you want from me? I wanted you to treat me like I mattered. Like I wasn't some piece of dog shit got stuck on your shoe. I did my damnedest with you. The truth is you were broke beyond fixing. What, are you some sort of super killer terror bomber now? You're on the wrong side, buddy. All them years, I was banging my head into the wall coming to see that everyone was against me. And when the Nazis took over, things got a lot better. You play by their rules, you can do very well for yourself. Ask anyone around these parts, Blaskowitz is a name of renown and respect. Everything you touch turns to shit, and I do not need your stink on my name. Wanted murderer. You run off to the army as soon as you come of age. You broke your mother's heart. Where is she? She's gone. When? What happened? Well, what happened is we had a big goddamn war, and now we got a new government with new rules. They took her. She gone. And what's that queer outfit you're wearing? What do you mean they took her? They rounded up all the Jews and the coloreds and the queers. This is a white man's world now. White man's got to keep it Christian. You sold her out. So what? Wife made a living bemoaning me and raised a boy into a murderer. Well, I always saw you for what you are. 10 pounds of shit in a five pound bag. On your knees. Daddy, I'm your son. Down on your fucking knees. Was a time I was scared of you. Was a time I'd have pissed myself, had a gun pointed at my head. You know what I feel right now? Not a goddamn thing. Who'd you call? I heard everything. Who in the hell'd you call? She's here. Gotta disable these claws.
should have run home. To you, Anya. Covering his mouth. Not my problem, it stays on. Oh, Christ. Will you just give us some privacy, please? Oh, you look like ass, man. Fuck. Looks like you're at death's door. Seriously, this is not a good look for you. Anyway, listen, uh, your trial's coming up in a couple of weeks, and after that, they're gonna execute you, and that whole charade's gonna be televised to every living room on the planet. So instead of that bullshit going down, we're gonna break you the fuck out of here right now. It's kind of a risky plan, but the security they have around you is out of this world, so it's kind of the only play we got, all right? I mean, the hoops I had to jump through to get to you, and I'm your fucking lawyer! That pissed me off. But, hey, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make like you attacked me, and when the guard pig comes in looking for your ass, I'm gonna sneak up behind him and I'm gonna shove this little number right into the base of his skull. I'm gonna grab his keys and his gun, and I'm gonna roll you right on out to the elevator. <laughs> Popping Nazis wherever they show up, straight down the garage, where boom, body and Anya and everyone else has the getaway car. Okay, you ready? Let's get this freak show on the road. <laughs> Oh. Fuck! That hurts so bad. You don't even know. Let's get this fucking gag thing off you. All right. Once we hit the street, it's all car chases and flying bullets. They got tanks outside, man. We got some tricks up our sleeve, though. And we make it that far. We make it. 
The hard part is getting down to the garage. Hey! Help! Help! Open the door! He fucking attacked me, man! He broke my nose, and then he got out through that door right there! Fucking Terror Billy! He's on the loose! Stay back. And, and, he, and he had help. Uh, they, they came in right through that door, and they broke him out. It was space aliens, man! <laughs> Schnitt! Cut! Sind wir was? Sie haben Talent. Sie sollten zum Film gehen, bei Helene vorsprechen. Guter Schuss, General. Der zuckt noch. <lacht> Idiot. He was dead as soon as he walked into the building. Tapfra, kleiner Liebling, ich bin dein und du bist mein Liebling, so lieblich und open your mouth, open, open it, that's it, huh? how does it taste? powder of the bullet that killed your friend. How does it feel? Do you love the taste? Oh! <laughs> you hear that? That's my attack force. Mm. Moving in on your friends in the garage. You're so boy. I'm gonna go down there now and join in on the fun. Anya, my family. Weeks pass, or more. Feel myself slipping away. Got me praying for the end. For theft and destruction of public and private property. Aiding the enemy, torture, terrorism, including nuclear, both domestic and abroad, and high treason. For gruesome murders that number in the thousands, you have been found guilty, Mr. William Joseph Blaskowitz. It is rare, even for a man of my job description, to come face to face with true evil. And it pains me that the maximum sentence that I can bestow upon you is something as trivial as Death! Death, Mr. Blaskowitz! Nothing but swift, sheer death! <laughs> Bailiff!
Mom. Oh, my son. I thought I lost you, Mom. I thought I'd never see you again. Oh, Billy. Life is full of unexpected things. Some make you cheerful. And some break your heart. I wasn't there when you needed me. I ran out on you. It hurt so much, Billy. It felt like my heart was being ripped out of my chest when you left. But all hardship is temporary. Do you know this? And most of it is inevitable. I had to stay behind so that you could leave. And now you're the one in trouble. Do not worry for me. My troubles are all for my son. I don't want to go back out there. I can't do this anymore. You are strong, Billy. We are survivors, you and I. We keep fighting even when we do not know how. You cannot help but be my son. I'm having twins, Mama. They're not born yet. I want to see them. I wanted you to see them. 
I miss you. We will be together. Soon. You just have one more hardship to... Daydreams stolen by cold winds of reality. Position. She's dropping it! Here at the Kinderlech, we have less than seven seconds. Okay, ready, steady, Max Bombate! Drop it! Oh. Oh. Anya, now! Oh. Hurry! We have three seconds! We need to give his brain oxygenated blood or it will die. Okay. Is he alive? Answer me, is he alive? I'm afraid it's too late. Oh, no. No. What? Brain activity! Yes! He's alive! Oh. Oh. Wow, man! Oh, this is just too far out there, Sans! He's on! Max is right. We should get out of here. The man ready for transport? Oh, God. Er ist tot. Scheiße. Das merke ich. Of immortal space fish swimming in his fishbowl. Hail, space fish! Mr. Vlaskovich, can you hear me? Uh huh. Okay, so listen to this. <clears throat> Some time ago, Caroline obtained this latest generation biologically engineered super soldier body from a Nazi scientific lab. Very, very impressive specimen. Anila, please show this to him. Look, William, Seth is going to attach this to build a connection between your head and your new body. Igor, Anya, Kindler, please, I'm a Nazi. My come and help me here. Now, these are very rare Nazi comfort equipment from super soldiers. Our fighters found in the field. None of them is working, but 
I have enough material to fix one contraption. You should decide which one you want. You can choose. Blink once for this one, blink twice for the one in the middle, blink three times for that over there. Okay, Yingala, let's get to work. I will sedate you now. See you soon. I'm not asleep, I'm God, and you got on you, got on you, got on you. How are you feeling, Mr. Blaskarich? Can you move your body? Yes, you can. Show us. Show us. I feel powerful. Do you remember your name? Do, do you remember your doings in the last two years? Aside from killing Nazis. <laughs> if you die one more time, William, I will murder you. <sighs> Come, I'll give you some clothes. Send them to me when you're done. Mm -hmm. uh, no, have you seen Ketzele? Where's the Gizine? Where's the Gizine? Shim Shim. I get the Shim Shim. Mr. Blaskovich. How I look? Like a new man, Yingle. A new man. Oh, I look at you. I'm so happy you're back. Now, this, same thing Shoshana has. This, no, 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 no. This connects your head to your body. Very, very important not to fiddle with this. Now, you might feel some weird tingling sensation, not to worry, it's normal. But let me know if anything else happens. For example, your head trying to reject your new body, something like this. Exhaust! Max! Max! I feel the same way, Max. Excellent. Excellent. Now, I, I have repaired the contraption you wanted. Put it on. Let's see what you could do with it. That's right, Mr. Blaskovich. Now, engage the battle walkers to reach to the top of the wall and climb over.
take back your wings. I don't need them anymore. Have you had a chance to speak to me? I just wanted to get some rest before we arrive at New Orleans. Mm, just such a long ride. Need a few minutes. Can you put your arms around me, William? I met him on you. I seen him and I wasn't afraid no more. Oh, William. And your mother? What happened in the garage? In the garage? First time you tried to rescue me, Frau Angle's men attacked you in the garage. I heard the gunshots. Oh, that was nothing. We had some tricks up our sleeve. <laughs> That's exactly what Super Spare said. Answer my question. Which one? Is this real? Or am I in heaven?
Lady. Let's see how the old man stacks up. Hey Blazkowicz. Should go see if Grace has a job for me. Max sure likes his crayons. Swimming space fish. Ah! You good, Captain? Ah, get off of me! Whoa, whoa, get off whoa, of me! Whoa, 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 Wyatt, Wyatt, you're putting the scare on me, man. Oh, sorry, man. Oh, I just had this vision. What do you mean, vision? Ah, there's this pile of bodies stacked up outside our house. I crawled out the window, hunted the pile, and I burrowed down to the bottom of the side. Magical rats lived in Hey, Captain Blaskowitz. in my ear this most terrible, wonderful secret. This, this world is a lie, man. This world is a lie. No, no, no. This is not a good vision. You're... <laughs> Blaskowitz, you are one tough motherfucker, you know that? What's all this? All this special shit from Roswell. He brought everything back from Mission Control and dumped it here. <laughs> Never had time to unpack it. He was a good man. I saw it go down. There was nothing I could do. What did he say? What? What were his last words? I need to know. He said, it was space aliens, man. <laughs> Motherfucker. He said, Oh, Ingle, how is everything functioning? Hi, Grace. This one of yours? What's this? Well, where did you get this? Especially had it back in Roswell. Said he found it at the crash site in 47. It looks like no, it can't be it. It's, but it oh got in you. Say. Got in you. I'm I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Grace. It's happening, Grace. It's a full-on assault. Have them run the engines as hot as they can. Full fucking throttle, sister. Yes, ma'am. I'll tell them. We're on a course for the New Orleans ghetto. Come on in, Blasco. Let's have a seat. Now, that ghetto was home to one of the last remaining resistance groups in America, led by a man named Horton. Now, after the war, the Nazis put up all these walls around the city. And then, they gathered up all the undesirables, and they dumped them there. So that Horton and his comrades and all these people are just stuck there, languishing in the worst conditions imaginable. And then, after the event of late, the Nazis, they just dialed up the pressure. Death squads storming the cities, killing everyone in sight. God damn it, they're gonna purge that whole city till there's no one left. We gotta do something. Right on. 
So now this new body of yours, is it ready for some Nazi killing? More ready than ever. Feel unstoppable. Shh. It's a fucking freight train. You are a fucking freight train. Now before we arrive in New Orleans, we need to make a quick detour into Manhattan. So you'll want to read the mission brief, activate the war map out there, and pull up the info screen for the Manhattan district. Got it. Oh, and Blaskowitz, one good thing did come out of all of this mess. Yeah, what's that? <laughs> Your execution is all over the news. <laughs> Nazis think you're dead, baby. They ain't never gonna see you coming. A long way we have come, fishman. Slowly the people are waking up. And payback is coming for the Nazis. Yes, it is. Yes, it is, my friend. level is high down there. Blaskowitz, find a way inside the nuclear bunker before the radiation levels, you know, kill you.
the Nazis keep the stolen intel inside their command center. You gotta find your way in there.
Langweilig. Mein Onkel Gerhard war vor dem Krieg geschäftlich hier und meinte, New York wäre die Stadt niemals schlecht. In Manhattan war vor der Zeit als atomare Einöde bestimmt mehr los. Wenn Onkel Gerhard zu Weihnachten einen Sitzen hatte, trug er immer einen Papierkorb als Zylinder und führte mit mir und meinen Cousins vor Heiden. Shooting cans with my BB gun. 
Except bigger can. Bigger gun. through that elevator shaft.
dossier Grace wanted. Guess that's my cue. Are you Nazis born in a barn? They're letting the radiation in. Achtung! Nördliche Dekontaminationskammer beschädigt. An alle Mitarbeiter legen Sie umgehend Ihr Atemgerät an. Ich wiederhole. Nördliche Dekontaminationskammer beschädigt. An alle Mitarbeiter legen Sie umgehend Ihre Atemgeräte an. Just get to higher ground and signal your location. I see you. Approaching now. 